I'm so glad it's almost over. Congratulations, sweetie. <laughs> Thank you. I'll never understand why you chose such a macabre field, There's nothing but... disturbing about it. It's just but that I... I'm proud of you. I really am. You've come so far. So, you haven't told me what's next. Will you get a job where you are, or...? They actually have everyone they need. But my old teacher, Mr. Delver, transferred me to his office to finalize my internship there. Oh, well, that's good. I remember you mentioning him. Where's he located? Are you moving away from me? <laughs> no. No, I'm not moving. He's actually located around here. Riverfields. Oh, Rebecca. I don't like that. Grandma. Even I've heard things about that place. I'd just be worried people about you. make up stories. Death is a scary thing to a lot of people. And we try to explain things we don't understand, and we want comfort when we lose someone we love. I mean, no one's embalming any ghost bodies or whatever. It's fine. Right, right. I'm sorry. But I wanted to give you this anyway. So, here. I, I don't know if I want that. Just take it, please. It should be yours anyway. Thanks. All right. Enough spooky stuff. I'm so proud of you. When is all this happening? When do you start? I've actually been there for a few weeks now. My review is tomorrow. Rebecca. Great. Perfect timing. I just finished with Mr. Dalton here. Please wheel him back to cold storage and bring us Mrs. Page.
All right, I'm just finishing up something here, so why don't you grab the clipboard and start recording identifying marks. I'll get out of your way when you're done and let you hop in here. These old windows never stay latched. Great. Climb on in here and put everything into the record system. Don't forget to take the printout to the front desk so Zoe can add it to the packet for the family. After that, we'll get started. You'll die here. What was that? I didn't say anything. You alright? Yeah. I'm fine. Sorry. Time to embalm. All right, I've set everything out so you can just go ahead and get started. I'll be monitoring. Everything's on your list there if you need it. There we go. Huh. 
All right. Anything else? Hmm. Sometimes we get chemicals that haven't been stored properly, and it can make them pop like that. Just keep doing your thing. I'll get it. There we go.
Tell you what. What? Why don't you go ahead and head out? I'll take over from here. Uh, are you sure? I just got here. Don't worry. You're doing great. I'll get the last of your paperwork sorted today and call you in for your first shift. Go ahead. It's fine. I'll give you a call when we get someone in. It was just really weird. So some stuff fell over. That's not a big deal. No, I know. It, it wasn't even my fault, but he sent me home right after that. I'm just really worried. He was supposed to finalize my stuff today. And he said he would, right? Yeah. So, that's a good thing. Yeah, it just didn't feel like he meant it. Like, like he just said it to get me out of the building. Uh, wait a sec, I have another call. Hello? Hey, Rebecca. It's Raymond. Oh, hi, Mr. Delver. Uh, look, if I did anything wrong today, just... No, no. Uh, I wanted to apologize. You've done a fantastic job. I'm just not... That's uh, actually why I'm calling. I know it's late, but we just got three new cadavers, and no one else can make it in right now. I was hoping you could come in and take care of them. Well, uh, yeah. Uh, are you sure? I mean, of course. <laughs> Excellent. You are doing me a huge favor. I took care of the rest of your onboarding. We're all set. And your new badges and your personal belongings drawer in the back room. That's great. Uh, thank you. I'm on my way right now. I hope you feel better. Thanks again. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Holy shit. That was him. He signed me on. He needs me to come in tonight. See? I told you it was fine. Congratulations. Thanks. I have to go. Like, right now. I'll talk to you later. Uh, where are my keys? So I'll head to the back and get started. Hi, Rebecca. M Mr. Delver, I need help. Someone's outside the mortuary. Just try to stay calm. I know you're scared. I'll unlock the door in a moment. What? This is very sudden. But listen to me. We have to start right away. I'm sorry. I didn't know until it made itself known this morning that it was here, let alone bound to you. I had no way of knowing the possession had started. What? Look, this isn't funny. Stop. You need to take this seriously. You need to act quickly. This is insane. I'll just leave. I'll, I'll just fucking leave. You can't leave, Rebecca. I, I can't allow that for you or for others. It's far too dangerous. <laughs> what am I supposed to do then? Most bodies I work with at night are fine. So we stay calm. Okay? We embalm, file the paperwork, everything. Treat it like a normal day. Staying focused will help. 
I left some things for you on the desk. I'll call again when you get to the embalming room. No, wait. Ugh. Damn it, what the fuck? This is insane. Okay. This is so stupid. It's just some hazing for the new girl or something. Just... Just play along and do your job. quitting tomorrow. I mean, who does something like this? All right, listen carefully. I'm, uh, look, I'm sorry, but this entire thing is extremely unprofessional. If this is how you treat new hires, I don't think I can work for you. This isn't funny. Rebecca, you don't have to believe me, but I hope you do before it's too late. The only way to save yourself is to banish the demon before you're too far gone. To do that, you will need to learn the demon's name, bind it to its chosen body, and burn it in the retort. Uh. Look, I know this is a lot to take in. I wish I could do more for you. I had years to learn what I know. You have hours. <sighs> I've recorded a number of cassettes to instruct you in the hope that having a physical object with a known message will help you stay grounded. I won't be calling again. You can't trust the phones. Anything can be manipulated. Listen to the tapes. Learn the demon's name. Burn the correct body. The most important thing in the room is in that cabinet. Open it up. Good luck, Rebecca. I'm sorry this had to happen. <laughs> this is insane. Whatever. Just be the professional one, grab a body, and get started.